بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ویلکم ٹو انادر ویڈیو آن لوڈنگ ٹو پوائنٹ فائیو ملین ریکارڈس ان ایکسل فار انالیسز ٹو ڈے ول شو یو ہاؤ یو کین اپلوڈ دس مچ ڈیٹا ان ایکسل یوزنگ پاور فیچرز آف مائکرو سافٹ ایکسل ٹو زیرو ون سکس And then we will try to analyze uh, something over there in Excel and we'll see how much time it will take to load this much data. Right? Okay, let's proceed. Okay, <clears throat> I uh, have downloaded the data from Kaggle.com. There's a too much data on this website uh, related to samples and you know for. Uh, analysis and etc so you can download and uh, the file size is around 819 MB it's a CSV file which is see I have uploaded and I have uh, unzipped as well so this is unzipped file size but once you will uh, zip file is not this much yeah okay <clears throat> so it has uh, records of uh, accidents happened in uh, US and uh, it has let's say temperature weather conditions other factors so for details you can go down and you have this each field detail of this file and some other details as well see here each field yeah each column so you can see that one as well and then <clears throat> let me show you how to upload data in excel okay i have just copied those columns here for reference purpose so you can see here just just a sample right okay now <clears throat> we need this power pivot but unfortunately I don't think so by default it will be there <clears throat> so what you have to do you have to go to file then options and add-ins and then at the bottom you have to select from here com and go so here you have to select this right so all these three power tools are selected so I don't need to worry okay now I'll click manage it was not clicked okay and then I will click here sorry from other sources and bottom there's a text file click next uh, on top it's text friendly and I have to select the file which I kept here and I will select the CSV and click see this is a CSV file and the size is right this much MB 838 MB right I click open okay now it will uh, take few records from the top to show us let's wait for that and then I will click the first row I have to say that this is um, these are my headings and now I will note down the time how much it is there let it complete okay it is 10 15 right so I will click finish now because it has to start now and it is comma uh, delimited it's already selected right so I don't need to worry and finish now it is importing data mm, it takes around last time it took me around four minutes if I'm not wrong yeah four minutes so just expecting this much at certain here uh, last time it was not showing any progress and then it continued but it's moving now okay meanwhile let me show you those uh, sorry here we can go columns okay so here we have different columns and the sample data is also there right so these are unique values this much two two four three nine three nine right this is source they use I think um, two APIs to collect this information then this there is a different start time and you know there is other information as well don't know how to scroll because scroll is at down okay another way is you can go to this link and then you can find a table which I 
copy it there in Excel. Uh, this chart is created from the same data, right? Okay, now here if you see, so it has different information, it has GPS coordinates as well, <clears throat> then it has humidity, it has uh, wind pressure, visibility, wind direction. So if any bump is there crossing, give way. So maybe it happened there, any accidents happened there, okay. It is close to station, uh, stop, or whatever. You know, this uh, sort of information is there. So now it is up to you how you can analyze. Okay, so this is the data and you can download it from kaggle.com. I will share the link under the video. K A W G L E dot com. So this whole link will be there so you can download. I think you have to register first time. If I'm not wrong, uh, you can download. Yeah, see here your profiles. So maybe you have to just yes, it's, it's free. Yeah, so you can uh, go through this and let me check how much that uh, it's not stopped. So you uh, please don't uh, stop here that it is not moving. Um, all of a sudden it will say that finished so it will just move quickly so you don't need to worry so I just took uh, 15 it's it will take around one minute I'm not if I'm not wrong because three minutes already gone so one one or one and a half minute it will take more right oh, so Excel here there you have the map I don't I don't want to touch it because it shouldn't destroy this process uh, let us wait for some time. Mm -hmm. Kaggle. Okay. Why I'm showing this? Right. Why I'm showing this in Excel? Actually, this is a part of my um, series of videos on convincing everyone to move towards data science and how you can analyze data. What kind of data is there? Uh, what will be the limitation of tools? What are the strengths of tools? So let's say for example the same data today. I am uploading in Excel uh, Next uh, in any video I will try to show in, uh, the same to be uploaded in Power BI uh, Tableau uh, Maybe Oracle Analytics as well uh, So uh, in, in, in in different uh, tools so you can see so uh, today I'm trying to show the power of Excel so you shouldn't say that oh Excel can't do and see it is uploaded all two point around 2.25 yeah millions and just click close this screen will be closed and you can see here you have the data now you can further apply some functions over here which at the moment I'm not doing it uh, just not to confuse you uh, there are so many powerful DAX functions you can apply over here, which I will not uh, try today at least in some other video. Okay, now let me click on pivot table, right? And then new worksheet because earlier I have something that over there. So now if you see here, I have this table loaded over here and I will say ID, let me put it somewhere here in the values. And then I will select uh, there is um, not city, not county, maybe state. Let me put it state because this will be less than others, right? See here. So now you have the data. I'm just showing you that how much see is uh, this much data is there uploaded. How much time it is taking? Okay. Now next, if you can go to analyze and you can say pivot so I mean I'm just showing you it's not something you should be doing the same so let's say for example line chart okay let me put it there okay just quick formatting for your uh, chart like these buttons I never recommend to be there so just right click and you can click here instead of uh, remove anything hide all fields buttons in so it in the bottom I don't need it this so just imagine in few clicks how 
the chart will look like here yeah? so this also you don't need because this is itself one color so you don't need it so just imagine just within few clicks we, and here you can put some chart over here I think it is state wise state state wise total accidents right this is how it is okay now <clears throat> another one is I would like to show you that will be in insert and no, sorry let me click here uh, here yeah you can open 3d maps mm, I will show you or you can use Excel instead of using other tools if you have the Excel because you are paying for Excel why, why not sh using all the features of Excel right so here it is so let me see if it had selected all those state is there postal code is there right so see it is uploading the data if you can see on the bottom it is uploading the data meanwhile I will click this one this one uh, as a heat map right so it will show a little bit sort of fancy and then I can move closer to it yes and then let's say for example value field what you want to show here in the value field so I will select something like humidity percentage and then instead of sum I would like it to be average right so just imagine I don't want it let me close this as well so this is how you can move around right just uh, let me do it here see so now you can analyze right let's say for example uh, accidents happened due to humidity where it was or uh, uh, it is it due to wind speed you know or something what was the direction so this might help uh, like uh, if you see still it is uploading data it is not yet loaded right into this so it is still loading let it load mm, you can change the different chart types I'm, I will not change now because otherwise it will start from zero again so now it is calculating this uh, average as well now ideally for such visualization tools this data should be already uh, summarized not that these visualization tools should do all these calculations that's sort of data warehouse concepts so you should keep everything ready and these visualization tools should be just uh, um, presenting the data final data I would say right okay still it is going on but anyway we will not wait for it uh, it's okay let it keep there so at least you got the idea from Excel I created the chart as well Google and then let me show you something here so you can change the type of this map as well they are sorry different All right so these are different themes you can select and then you can move closer whatever you want just like any other right so it's I hope it will help you okay let me close it and this uh, data is there let me save it all right so meanwhile it is saving I think it will take some time <clears throat> okay now this was Excel it is saved uh, you can create dashboard based on this so I just use a CSV file it's not a database or anything else uh, something else and there's indexing or nothing is there it's just a plain CSV file right we used uh, to create chart we also created uh, 3d map as well and then you can create some other data as you like 
there is a pivot chart over here it depends I mean you can use recommended charts are there based on this you can uh, create right I hope you like the video if you liked or if you didn't like please share your feedback because it will help us to perform better or uh, improve our quality right and please subscribe to the channel so you will uh, get next um, videos as well i'm planning to uh, do a few couple of videos on tableau and uh, power bi to give you comparisons and we will upload the same data and we'll see the performance right and thank you allah hafiz